This is the ICU unit that I talked about last week, and we were conditioning Coco to go in it. Well, it was Cookie's turn. Many of you asked what kind it is. It's a cradle, C-U-R-A-D-L-E, 90. I like it because you can hook up an oxygen concentrator, a nebulizer, and it adds humidity if you fill up where the water part is. It was recommended for Cookie to get used to it. Because he's had a stroke before, we need to have something like this on hand. In case he has another stroke, we can just plop him in there and uh, there'll be oxygen and all that in there for him. Cookie is not hand tame and that's why I'm using the carrier. He will always step up on the carrier. You can tell that he doesn't want to go in there, but I eventually get him to perch a bit. But he's not petrified. He just would rather not. A scared bird will, like, flee and fly. But he just would, doesn't want to go in. We'll give it another try. I had to get a better grip on the carrier. A lot of people think I should just put him on my hand and carry him around. Well, that's impossible. He is afraid of hands and fingers and all that stuff. I put a little treat in there so he can see it. His favorite is a walnut. Okay, Cookie, let's try this again. He doesn't want to. Okay, Cookie. This is where he actually gets steps up. And I plop him right in. Come on, Cookie, get in there. There he goes. This is just brief. He doesn't want to be there. He needs to know that it's not going to kill him because if he does end up in there, then he won't be too scared. He doesn't notice the cookie I gave him. There he goes. Look, cookie. You want a tree? There he is. So he can start associating this with something good like walnuts. He doesn't get walnuts anymore, but he will get one if he goes in there. So I just let him sit in there for a little bit while he eats his snack. And then I'll bring him out. There we go, Cookie. Good job. And then next time, I will just let him stay in there for a little bit longer. Same with Coco. I'll, I'll leave them in a little bit longer, and then eventually I'll start closing the, the lid on it. Then they'll get used to it with the lid closed. It rolls down. Anyways, good job, Cookie. Good job. This is the life of Boba Bobo. This is the life of Boba Bobo. This is the life of Boba.